And also, so did mine. And also, we got to steal different types of chickens. And also, I can't believe the blue eggs taste the best. Wow, that sounds good. I heard a, the silk feather chicken lays blue eggs. I want to have one so I can take the delicious chickens. Okay, does that mean you want to make chicken nuggets out of them? No, I just yeah. want to taste the eggs. Yeah, because you don't have an infinite supply of chicken legs. You have an infinite supply of eggs, though. Yep. Well, we can go. Did you see the baby pigs? They were so cute. The mama oh, yeah. was nursing, and it was so cute. Oh, yeah. And also, um, what about the tractor ride? Because um, that's for last. Yep, the, the, the coach. Um, Tractor, she said, he, he went through all of the other classes and she said, we saved the best for last, so we went on the tractor first. And also, he said, hoods up, which means horns up means this. And it means to be quiet. We also loved, and my one of my favorite things was the little pigs. That was super cute. I am so excited. And also, I can't even believe how cute those little rabbits were. I didn't remember seeing any rabbits, but that sounds cute. And also, I can't believe I saw roosters there. They weren't cocky doodle doing, so I think they're most broken. Whoa! Halloween was really fun too. Yeah, and also, I, I think Madison forgot about the break and also the minimum days we're having, like the one right now. And also, don't forget about Thanksgiving to think about your favorite things. And we don't have school. I really like school. I know, I'm, I'm sad too. But at least that means a couple more days for me to hang out with my family and play with my kittens. Back to the studio. Hello, Mark Offer, Miss Jessica here to talk to you about some upcoming events in the library. First off, I want to talk to you about our All for Coins book drives coming back this year, November 18th through the 22nd. I've added something really special this year. The classroom that brings in the most money each day will end up earn us party at the end of the day. So our Penny Monday, if you bring in the most pennies, you're going to have a popcorn party. Nickel Tuesday class that brings in the most nickels is going to earn a nacho party. Uh, Dime Wednesday will earn you a donut hole party. Corridor Thursday will earn you a cookie party. And Free For All Friday, the classroom that brings the most money on Friday, will get french fries at the end of the day. Reminders will be coming home with you. Look for this flyer. That's all I got for you guys today. Back to you. Mm -hmm. okay. Back to you. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you. Hi, I'm Ellie. And I'm Jayla. Hey Ellie, do you know a lot about our mark off or playground rules? Well, what are they? No pushing or shoving and you should always wait for your turn. Well, PBIS made a perfect video that, for that. Let's see.
think that video was really helpful. Yeah, it was great. Out, make sure you're doing the right thing outside. Back to you. Hi everyone, this is Madison. And this is Quinton. So what's going on with Student Council, Madison? <laughs> First thing we have is Nerd Day on the 22nd of no November. Wow, that seems fun. We also have Wintergrams coming up. Awesome, I can't wait. I'll make sure to get my friends some Wintergrams. Me too. Also, did you know about the coin drive? No, actually, I didn't know about it. When does it start? It starts from the 18th to the 22nd of November. Wow, great to know. On Monday, you bring in pennies and yeah, you get popcorn. Tuesday, you bring in nickels and you get nachos, nacho cheese. Wednesdays, you bring in dimes and you get donut holes. Thursday, you bring in quarters to get cookies. And Friday, you bring any kind of coin and get french fries. Awesome, also, did you know about the pudding cups we are getting for the fences? No, I didn't know, what are we getting? We are getting a running Mustang, our PBIS rules, and Mustang Pride. Wow, that's so cool. Well, back to you. Hi, this is Paige. And this is Sophia with the Weather Corner. Isn't the fall weather nice, Paige? It sure has. It's been beautiful. I thought it might be a good idea to give everyone some fall weather tips. You may have noticed it is getting darker, darker earlier in the day due to daylight saving time. Tip number one, make sure you wear light colored clothing to help drivers see you during your evening activities, especially if you need to walk along the sidewalk or near a road. Flashlights and reflective tape can help also help drivers see you. So what you're saying is wearing dark clothes at night is a bad idea? Yes, it could be dangerous. Wear nice bright colors for your safety. Now to the actual weather, we will be con continuing to have warm afternoons and cool mornings and evenings. It has been so cold that I need an extra blanket to keep warm. Now that's a good idea. Well, that's our weather report this week. I hope everyone enjoys this false weather season. If you ever have any weather questions or tips, drop them off in Miss Knowles' room, room number 29. Stay cool, my Mustang, Mustangs. Back to you. Welcome back to Jokes. You guys gave us some really good jokes. Let's pick a few to share. This one comes from Delaney Cleaner. Why did the cow go to the road? Uh, to move the cars. <laughs> Let's pick another one to share. This one comes from Jacqueline Landrum. Why did the dog cross the road? Because it wa it wanted a hot dog. <laughs> Let's pick our last one. This one comes from Melina and Mrs. Vanderspeck. Class. Why are egg jokes so funny? Because they crack you up. <laughs> <laughs> the, keep them coming. The box is going to be outside Miss Knowles' room Monday and Tuesday. Back, Back on to you at the studio. studio. What's saying? These are the right answers. The, the these are the wrong answers. Let's pick five to share. Our first winner is Emily Robertson, third grade, Mrs. Morford's class. Our second winner is Sidney from Mr. Johnson's class. Our third winner is Lucas Mc Mickus. Adams, third grade Mr. Johnson's class. Um, our our um, fourth winner is Mr. Johnson from, from third grade Mr. Johnson's class. And our final winner is Connor Joy Joy's third grade Mr. Johnson's class. Those are all the right right answers. Remember, only guess once. Look for the Mass Mustang box outside Mrs. Mole's room Mondays and Tuesdays. Our Mass Mustang was Mr. Zender. Welcome back to Mass Mustang. In this challenge, you'll try to guess another staff member that works here at Florence Markoff for elementary school. This Mass Mustang's favorite thing to drink is water. 
This mess mustang's favorite animal is a cow. This mess mustang's favorite place to go is Tahoe. This mess mustang's favorite color is black. Can you guess who this is? Look for the mess mustang box outside Mrs. Noah's room Monday and Tuesday. Thanks, Jet and Alex. Yeah, I also really enjoyed seeing all the fun events that our, our school had. Me too. Well, that's it for today. This is Alexis. And Josephine, signing off. Bye, Bye Mustangs! Mustangs.